Okay, so I screwed up, as I usually do in these things. That's why it's handy to have um, uh, people that know what they're doing. Anyway, so uh, this is about the still in uh, Cancer Ward, uh, Episode 5. Uh, I'll splice this in. Uh, basically, what I was going to say, though, was that uh, the hypervibe and everything is, is, and I use other other exercises. Uh, I've got all different kinds of things here for various different kinds of muscle um, responses. So I don't usually do these kind of things, but you can see I'm building back up the muscle mass. Got a decent uh, amount coming on in. And it's a it's an effective kind of an exercise uh, because it aids the hypervibe, uh, because it aids the ability to actually do real uh, movement exercises. Um, in let me see if that will affect. Hang on, let's see. There we go. It makes it a little easier. Okay, so I'm going to try the rings here and just just show you real quick. So, you know, it's real, real muscle. This is, um, this is a boon, right? Being able to get back and get healthy again. So uh, I'm going to go into my next uh, video now and I'll edit these together. But uh, basically, immunotherapy is achieved uh, for, as an anti-cancer is achieved with all of these various things. I recently added the nitric oxide. It makes a lot of sense to do so, in my opinion. And I'm continuing to use the GC Math Plus products uh, and uh, have yet to have the, any more of these tests just because it's a bloody pain in the ass to get into town uh, to the blood draw place, which is an hour away. And then I, you have to go fasting and then I've got to go have breakfast and it eats up, you know, the huge chunk of the day doing all of this kind of stuff. Um, but I will get around to it. We've got to, uh, we've got to be doing some uh, traveling here and I'll make a point of arranging it such that I can get blood and then go on about my business. Um, anyway, so uh, keep on keeping on. Uh, cancer is indeed a very painful, nasty scourge, uh, but there are many things that we can do uh, to deal with this shit. Guess that's it. So now on to the next one.